Did you know that this tiny ant can pose a serious threat to small mammals and other wildlife? Today we're exploring the fascinating yet impactful world of the yellow crazy ant, scientifically known as Anoplelepis gracilipes. Let's learn about its characteristics, behavior, and the significant effects it has on ecosystems and economies worldwide. Originating from Africa and parts of Asia, the yellow crazy ant has now become an invasive species in many regions, including Pacific Islands, Australia, and parts of the Caribbean. Named for its unpredictable, crazy movement, this small but highly influential ant warrants our attention. Now, how can you identify the yellow crazy ant? They are relatively small, about 3 to 4 millimeters long. Their coloration is distinctive, a bright vivid yellow to caramel color, which makes them stand out. Unlike some ants, they have long slender legs and antennae giving them a graceful appearance. Their eyes are quite prominent, and they move erratically, hence the name crazy ant. Another key feature is their shiny exoskeleton and the ability to quickly change direction, making them difficult for predators and humans to catch. Yellow crazy ants are highly aggressive and omnivorous. They forage across wide areas, feeding on a variety of foods including other insects, sugary substances, and even plants. Their rapid erratic movement combined with their large colonies, often numbering in the hundreds of thousands, allows them to dominate their environment quickly. In their invasive range, they often displace native ants and disrupt local ecosystems. They tend to honeydew-producing insects like mealybugs and scale insects, which can lead to increased plant pests. This creates a cascade of ecological imbalance. Ecologically, the yellow crazy ant threatens native biodiversity. They prey on ground-nesting birds' eggs and chicks, ground-dwelling insects, and even small reptiles like small skinks and geckos, leading to declines in native species. Economically, their presence can impact agriculture and tourism. Infested plantations may see reduced yields, and the need for control measures can be costly. Managing these ants is challenging. Control methods include baiting, biological control, and habitat management, but, you know, preventing their introduction is key. The yellow crazy ant is a prime example of how invasive species can alter ecosystems and affect economies. Awareness, early detection, and responsible management are essential to, well, minimize their impact. By understanding these tiny yet powerful insects, we can better protect our environment and manage unwanted invasions. Thanks for watching.